Made it this far in the Champions League, but there is one more significant hurdle to clear, and that is the semi final hurdle. Who's going to make it? It's Atletico Madrid. They take on Inter next on EA TV. And plenty of excitement around here in the Spanish capital. We're at the Estadio Metropolitano. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And we've got Champions League semi-final first leg action coming right up for you. It's Atletico Madrid up against Inter. Well, this is what the Champions League is all about. Some of the world's best players, two excellent teams and a great stadium. Let's hope we're not disappointed. And here are the starters for Atletico. Jan Oblak stands between the posts. Marcos Llorente starts alongside Koke in central midfield. And up front, Antoine Griezmann starts alongside Morata. Very effective passing sequence. Cutting it back. And a look at the Inter team. Jan Zoma is the goalkeeper. Alessandro Bastoni plays with Francesco Acerbi in central defence. Nicolo Barrella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today, Lautaro Martinez plays alongside Marcus Turam. It needs an accurate cross. Into the centre from Mkhitaryan. Appear to be in two minds. And did just enough defensively. Not made it look routine, but read it well. Turam. Barella. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Inter in a position of menace. Francesco Acerbi but if you're going to challenge like that it has to be spot on what do the referee think of it and it is red he's been given his marching orders well it's a definite red he's put his team under a lot of pressure now it is an Atletico substitution Mopping up defensively. Riesma. It's with Saul. Axel Witzel. Rodrigo de Paul. Take it away. He won the ball. And Inter might be able to cash in here. But the danger averted for now. Chalanoru. Barella. On to Martinez. Back with Barella. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Must take the lead here, and a goal! The opening statement in this semi-final, how important can that prove to be? Well, as you can see, what an excellent back heel this is to set up the goal, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Well, frustration for Simeone. He needs to get a reaction from his players now. So, underway again here. 1 0 the score. Very quick thinking there. 
Lino. Marcos Llorente. Llorente. On to Saul. Well, they get themselves level here. Must be. And he's kept it out. Fully stretched. Somehow reaching it. in by Griezmann pressure on to clear his lines and they've done it a goal for Atletico who now are level well let's look at this again it's a decent delivery into the box and then what a great finish as well good connection with the ball leaving the keeper with little chance it's a great goal level contest 1-1 Alessandro Bastoni on to Mkhitaryan Chalanolu Barella and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end Saul De Paul Advantage Atletico. Griezmann. Had a chance to whip it in here. Oh, last ditch defending at its very finest. Oh, that surely had to go in, but marvellous defending. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Barella. Back to Chalhanolu. Can he convert? Nicely blocked. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Well, no complaints as regards Saul and his performance so far. What did you make of it? Well, he stepped forward for his team with the equaliser. It could prove to be the key turning point in this contest, as they haven't been at their best today. You do feel they need to find another gear in the second half, though, if they are to go on and win it. So back underway here into the second half. Oh, he's given us away. Danmian. Well, it's all about passing as they try to hit the front. He's in here. A magnificent stop. Well, it should be a goal, but take nothing away from the keeper. That's a brilliant save. And taken short. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. Saul. And Inter doing well to regain possession. Turam. Marcos Llorente. 
Saúl. A lot of momentum to this Atletico attack. Can they take the lead? That was going in. Martinez. And there's the feed into the box. Taking care of business defensively here. 30 minutes to go then. Samuel Lino. It's with Hermoso. Lino. And strong play here. And options in the centre. Saúl. Now Griezmann. Samuel Lino. Oh, a really untidy loss of possession. And the decision offside here. De Frey into the final 20 minutes and now De Frey will find use of the ball and a lot to like about this attack really fine piece of defending play to break us up Hermoso. Well, if Atletico score now, this place will erupt. The fans have been brilliant today. Marcos Llorente. Marcos Llorente has it. Antoine Griezmann waiting. Sound piece of defending. Marcus Tuhan could be a chance to break here. Tuham. It's with Chalhanolu. And still they are locked together. Inter remain on the attack near the end. Mikitarian. Blocking it. Mikitarian. Body in the way again. the pie it's with Hermoso Griezmann De Paul Marcos Llorente has it decent position for Atletico to find themselves in just can't get it past him now the quick counter attack could be on incisive pass and defensive play to be applauded. Lino. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Inter still on the attack in the game's closing moments. A level contest. Can they forge ahead? Look like a certain goal, but that's a great challenge. And there's the final whistle, a thoroughly entertaining semi-final first leg. And I must say, Stuart, it bodes well for the return match. Yeah, fantastic first 90 minutes, wasn't it? Exactly what you want to see at this stage of the competition. Let's just hope they can replicate that in the reverse fixture. Well, he caught the eye at times in this particular match, didn't he, Stuart? Well, he summed up the team's performance. He did OK without being at his best. He can certainly do a lot better.